Hey YouTube, this is JD, and thank you for viewing the JD and Josh Sims McManus channel. Guess what? We're playing Sniper Ghost Warrior 3 again. Um, don't have much to say. Oh, yes, I do. <laughs> Guess what I'm going to talk about? Of course, the Ghost State Warriors has done it again. <laughs> Woo! Can we say 3-0? and oh? And they play tomorrow, which is Friday, because today is Thursday. They're going to play at Cleveland. Game four. I have a feeling. Golden State going to pull out that broom. And it's going to be a what? A sweep. Yes. All you Cleveland, LeBron James, crappy Cavalier fans will be shut the hell up and I can't wait to just rub it in everybody's faces that they're always all on LeBron James tip saying he's the GOAT and all that when, when we all know the GOAT and will always be Michael Jordan why Michael Jordan I don't care how outstanding a player now these days are the GOAT will always be Michael Jordan because Michael Jordan set the standards on how the game is played he set the standards on how to wear wear on the court what to wear on the court the shoes no one thought about ever th thought about what they're doing now until until Michael Jordan did it he changed the way basketball shorts are made now it used to be up to up to mid thigh level during the magic magic Johnson Larry Bird time frame then when Michael Jordan came in he changed the shorts because he didn't like it being up that high. He changed it to where it was just above the knee or right at the knee. Michael Jordan set the standards when it comes to shoes. He was the one, the first one to start to come up with his own, own uh, brand of tennis shoes, the Air Jordans. So, yeah, LeBron James, I'm not taking nothing away from the man. He's, he's a good basketball player, but I, I'm sorry. LeBron James, to me, my opinion, truthfully, is the GOAT in first place. Second, even though I don't particularly care for the dude, Kobe Bryant. Kobe Bryant has done things that LeBron James can't do. He couldn't do. What I mean by that, Kobe took the team, took the Lakers uh, to the championship, to the finals, and won it basically by himself without with mediocre players he didn't have any real support and if you don't know what I'm talking about I'm not talking about during the time frame when Shaq was with him I'm talking about when after Shaq left look at the help that Kobe Bryant had he took the team he took the Lakers to the championship and carried him on his back and he won the game LeBron can't do that he has to have support so that's why I don't particularly care for LeBron James I have no respect for him. All his ill nanas are crying, saying uh, he's he's just as good as Michael Jordan. Why is nobody comparing him to Jordan? Or, or blah blah blah. LeBron, shut up. Seriously, dude, just take your winnings, take your your accolades that you have right now, and just just be happy with that. Stop come, trying to compare yourself to someone else. You will never live up to the standards of Michael Jordan. Kobe didn't do it. So I don't know why you doing it or trying to do it. But anyways, Friday, game four, Golden State's going to take it. They're going to sweep the Cavaliers, and I'm going to laugh my behind off, and I'm going to post it right on Facebook. But that's enough of sports. Let's get to Sniper, Ghost Warrior 3. All right, YouTube. The game is finally, uh, finally uploaded, so let's... Uh, Get to what our next mission is going to be. Let's see the lair. Raquel found the location of a base where a lot of high tech gear is being shipped from all over the world. It may be the possible hideout of Amazai and his crew. Infiltrate the facility and report your findings. <laughs> Soviet base called the Lair. I think it's the location with all the answers. 
Robert? All clues point in that direction. It's the headquarters for Armazi and his crew. If Armazi doesn't have Robert, he knows who does. No one would hold back answers from a friend like Armazi. So we're close. So close, I can smell the gun oil. I'm tired, Frank. One last big push, right? There's a ton of high-tech gear that's been shipped in there. Find it, John. And find Robert. One way or another. Alright, you heard what you gotta do, so let's get to it. Uh, let's pull up the trusty map, see what what we can what we're gonna run into. Uh, I'm not gonna even well if I ain't gotta climb no rocks and no crazy crazy stuff, I'll try to hit that up. Let's see what's that. And let's see, go around here. Same thing here. If I ain't got to do a whole lot of climbing, I'll hit that up. So, let's, let's get to this. Let's do this. Hope y'all having a, a wonderful Thursday. I plan to take the wife and and my son, my other son, to go see um, Tom Cruise's new movie, The Mummy, at night. I have a good feeling. Well, the trailers it looked good, so I'm hoping that the movie was gonna be actually good so oh I remember that I couldn't find a way in and I didn't know how to shut that electricity off never mind we're gonna keep rolling uh, let's go to the map take off that waypoint and just go ahead If some of you haven't seen Wonder Woman, you got to go see it. That was a really good movie. Uh, DC did an outstanding job on that movie. Uh, Gal Gadot, goodness gracious. Woo! She makes me want to go to Israel. <laughs> Find me another woman. Uh, wife? Mistress? Sugar mama? I don't know. But, huh. Oh. Man, she does Israeli women justice. That woman is fine. <laughs> I thought she she had it going on when she played in Fast and Furious, but she... I was kind of questioning her being Wonder Woman because I remember Wonder Woman of old when Linda Carter was playing it, how busty she was. Even though Linda Carter didn't have much of a booty. Well, she didn't have a booty at all. But, uh... If you look at the Justice League cartoons, uh, how Wonder Woman is shaped, she had muscle, a little bit of muscle on her, but she was... She was... He uh, heavy chested, and she had a, a nice... Nice... A nice booty on her. I I'm... I'm sorry, I'm a booty man. I'm not too much of a, a chest, uh, tits man, but I like a, I like a woman with a nice behind. Well, especially a white woman with a nice behind. Preferably a non-black woman with a nice behind. But anyways, uh, yeah. Gal Gadot, she, ooh. And I'm a sucker for a, a brunette. And she, she does Wonder Woman justice. I... 
I eat, I eat my words about her. So, yeah. Hands down, she, oh, she does one, she plays Wonder Woman well. And I was kind of questioning whether or not to even go see the Justice League movie, but even though I'm somewhat of a Batman fan, I know Ben Affleck, he, I have a good feeling he'll play a good Batman. He plays, he plays a good Batman from what I've seen of him and Batman vs. Superman, even though that movie wasn't all that great. But he plays a pretty good Batman and a serious, serious role of uh, Bruce Wayne. And even though he had he didn't have a lot of uh, uh, roles in Suicide Squad, but the little bit of roles he did play in, he made Batman look good. I don't like the suit. I wish they actually get do the more updated version of the suit. Okay, son. Let's recap before I get any more confused. The Separatists used outside help to smuggle the weapons, gear, and material in Georgia. Yeah. Then they sold the gear to local criminals. Yeah. And then. Vasilis moved into the lair, and it finally disappeared. Yep, I think that's it. Christ, I'm impressed. No wonder foreign intelligence had trouble tracking that contraband. Yeah, but complicated plans have a way of fucking up. Can't control all the circumstances. <laughs> like surprise visitors dropping in the region and creating havoc? Yep, that would be us. But anyways, uh, getting back to what I was saying, um, yeah, I think Ben Affleck, I'm not going to see Justice League because of just uh, Ben Affleck. I'm going to see it because of Gal Gadot. I don't like the way they portray uh, Aquaman. Aquaman was, yeah, he was tall, but he was a blonde. Not what the dude they got playing right now, even though he, he's a good, he's a good actor. So, especially how he played in Game of Game of Thrones, I liked him in Game of Thrones. I didn't particularly like how he was banging my girlfriend in that, you know. But he's dead now. So, anyways, yeah. Well, that's my little movie review of and everything. Let's see what's going on. Start tagging some guys here. I have to trust the drone. Let's see here. Nope, civilians. Alright. Inside. It's just a bunch of soldiers, Frank. There's nothing here. Yeah, fine. I'll check out the tunnels, Frank. Good man. Keep me posted. Alright, civilian there. Hmm. So you want me to go in there? Oh, let me bring that down. Snap, a juggernaut. <laughs> what the? Stop! I'm going for bullets. There we go. Let's go with these all purpose rounds. Armor piercing around me. This dude is going to be a problem. We need him to turn around so I can hit that head. So I hit him in the back. Just gonna raise the alarm. <sighs> Great. No, oh, I better yet just see if I can do a workaround.
He's looking the other way. I'm in, and I have a feeling I'm not alone down here. Have a look around and keep your eyes peeled. There's probably cameras down there. Oh no, I've lost it. Sucks. Are you freaking serious? Oh, there's a camera. Dang it. What the freaking cameras? Woo, that's close. Uh, yeah, okay. <coughs> Jump up. Do it a mission impossible. All right, <coughs> and jump. that climbing up he's reaching for something what is he reaching for I don't see nothing to grab <coughs> ah man okay that makes no sense climb all the way no come on why are you not climbing all the way up this game is not making any sense people all right let's look down let's see Thank you. See no cameras. I have. I like getting hit with a camera. Oh snap! Okay.
Hey, what's wrong? You okay? Oh, man. I should have picked up that body. All right, let's go back to the last checkpoint. Come on, man. Let's go. Shouldn't take that long for you to bring up the game. this body. Frank, we're looking over some security cam footage. These men are wearing similar gear to what we saw in Kazori. They must be part of the same group. Try to gather some concrete proof. I'm already downloading the footage. That'll do nicely. Get out of there as soon as you're done. Huh. Okay. Ah, uh, nah. This goes to escape the tunnels. Now I'm clear to do. Uh, the tunnel gates just closed right Oh, you serious? <laughs> Shit. They must know you're there. Any suggestions? A tunnel network like this must have some sort of ventilation system. Maybe you can use that. Worth a shot. Uh, time to bring out the. Oh, what the? Stop, you cheating! Dirt thing! Oh, you cheating! Mother. Oh, stop. Doggone it, man. Hitting the the right pad and the darn drone keeps popping up. It's like, oh, we made it a little bit too easy for him. Let's, let's cheat. Okay. Excuse me, I'm about to sleep. <laughs> Excuse me. Woo! What the? Why you keep sliding through the baseball slide? It's got to be. Can you hide the body? No, no, it's not gonna let me hide it in there. Okay. All right, let's do this. Man, let me hold on. Let me s switch. Switch. 
Thank you. Thank you. Uh, no, I'll leave it on. some security cam footage. These men are wearing similar gear to what we saw in Kazori. They must be part of the same group. Try to gather some concrete proof. I'm already downloading the footage. That'll do nicely. Get out of there as soon as you're done. Suggestions? A tunnel network like this must have some sort of ventilation system. Maybe you can use that. Shoot, okay. Worth a shot. We are surrender. Don't shoot us. Oh, uh, where? Thank you. Now, is it going to let me out this time? Nice. Oh man, I got a new weapon unlocked. Hold your fire. Armazi has an offer. On your knees, North. Down, boy. <laughs> Really? Not okay. a popular decision. I prefer to shoot you now. Your brother is dead. When? How? I killed him. But he was ready to go, John. Happy to go. Torture? You son of a... Do you believe in resurrection, John? What the fuck? You monster! You're a believer, aren't you? That's... What I offer. Resurrection? Yeah. You're insane. Take I off the helmet so we can see who you are. Armazi. Told you I knew it. I, I knew really it was his brother. <laughs> I told God, you. Robert. I can explain everything. I your told you it was only. his brother. I knew it. Turn off your earpiece. Beautiful, isn't it? You were right, John. I was bitter and lonely. I didn't believe in anything. I had nothing but doubts. Questions and doubts. Now, I have certainty. Absolute certainty. What did they fucking do to you? They showed me the future, brother. And I want you to join me. 23 society is everywhere in your precious church in your beloved marine corps right this legendary covert international death machine is going to change the world oh john first they ignore you then they laugh at you then they fight you and then you win you may fight us but we will win 
You're quoting fucking Gandhi to justify murdering children and drowning their parents in rivers of blood? You're a goddamn terrorist! I am one ghost warrior among many. If Big only the strong too. survive, we show the people their strength. What the fuck, Robert? It all sounds incredible, I know. When I was captured, I fought them hard. But no matter yep, they how many too. times I tried to escape, it was as if they could read my mind. And then, then they showed me something. Just hear me out. Special scientific enhancement, cutting edge, unbelievable stuff. That helmet I shot out of your hands? If you held up a donut, I could have shot clean through the middle hole. Yeah, sorry, pal, but no one is that good. You see that hawk up there? No. That's why I was willing to let Robert die in order to be raised up as our mozzie. They will enhance your body and mind until you can do anything. We gotta go, boss. Let us raise you up to resurrection as one of us, John. Boss, we gotta go now. Come with me. Believe. Now, Bird is leaving. What did they do to you? What crazy shit did they do? I love you, brother. Really? They just gonna let me go like that? After everything they just told me? Okay. But I knew it. I knew it was gonna be his brother. They brainwashed him. They brainwashed. They had to brainwash him. Cause if you remember at the first, the first video I did when they was uh, doing their first mission together, he was talking about getting married after this mission. I'm sorry, in real life, I think a wolf would have pounced on him as soon as he saw him. He wouldn't have had the opportunity to turn that rifle on him. I thought it'll kill me. You did good. He looked me in the eyes. You did what you had to. That's how it works. You just pull this damn trigger. You kill or you get killed. That boy I beat up? He said you die up there. That you'll come back in a coffin like the soldiers on the news. I'll come back. Living and breathing, I promise. A war in Afghanistan is not enough to break apart the North, brothers. You hear me, Rob? I will always be there for you. a short mission I didn't even do no darn killing not like I wanted to I wanted to take out the whole darn base yes I know I have a I have a problem I'm a serial killer in the video game not in real life you know there are some people I would love to be able to just put my hands around their necks and just anyways uh, yeah so this the end of this mission let's see what's up next after this, I got a 100% sniper rifle accuracy. I didn't shoot anybody with my sniper rifle, so whatever. Okay, they gave me 100%. I'm going to take it. Robert's gone. What? He's left the region? What happened, John? Robert's dead. He's gone. He's resurrected. 
Robert's the fucking enemy. Slow down, son. He's a mozzie. Robert is a mozzie. But how? Better soldiering through science. They turned him into a 23 Society super soldier. The sniper who made the impossible shot at the wedding, that was a turbocharged Robert. Wait a minute, Robert? This whole secret society thing is real? Yeah, real as a fucking heart attack. Take a breath. Slow down. Take a breath. Take a breath. I cannot fucking breathe at all. Oh, God. Okay. Okay. 23 Society got him. Did some kind of chemical DNA mind-enhancing shit. Mixed in some high-tech super weapons and made him this... This fucking science experiment. And he's proud of it. Wanted me to join him. We've all heard rumors, but... Says they're everywhere. At the highest levels of government, the military, even the fucking marines. Says we're surrounded and don't even know it. John, we're all here. We're surrounding you. We've got your back. Lydia's right. This is a problem we can figure out. It's not a problem, Frank. It's a fucking betrayal. It's... Treason. Jonathan North, I have an assignment for you regarding your recent exploits at the lair. My man is in contact with Mr. Sims, but he needs to see oh, him in person before he can trust hey. him. I'm sending you his location. Oh, when they made this game, they were thinking of me. Ah, who knew? All right. All right, let's see here. Should I do any killing here? Let's see. Get down. Uh, let's see. There's the juggernaut. Uh, let's see. Where's all those guys I was... Around. Nothing but a bunch of civilians. Okay, never mind. Let's go back to the. Let's go back to the safe house. Uh, there's a lot of stuff I need to hit up here. All right, I'm going to end it here. I will be right back to give up, uh, put up the next episode on the next mission. I'll see you then. Peace.